The number one chronic illness among children is dental disease. And that includes cavities and gum disease, but trying to treat those conditions without insurance can be costly. As Delane Cleveland reports in today's Health Check, there's a program that parents can take advantage of to ensure their kids get the dental care they need. The dental need amongst children is very widespread. Saturday morning in Golden Valley, dentists were hard at work with drills, suction machines, and all of the other necessary tools to clean and okay. fix teeth. But he just, he also has a cavity up here. On this busy day, every one of these professionals at Bassett Creek Dental did this work strictly on a volunteer basis. We have approximately oh, 20 to 25 volunteers here in our office. We're going to see between 35 to 40 kids over our half day. I'm going to lean the chair back now. This is one of 200 clinics across Minnesota taking part in an annual event called Give Kids a Smile, where children whose families can't afford or access quality dental care receive that care free of charge. It is not the solution, but it definitely has an impact amongst the kids in our state. It also has an impact on parents such as Vanessa Padua Evans. Presently, I'm a graduate student and my husband's a chef, so financially it helps. How are you doing? She brought in her five and a half year old daughter, Margo, for her first ever visit to the dentist. Kind of rinse right away. And it turned out to be quite the memorable trip. Going to the dentist for the first time and then saying, oh, well, you have your permanent molars. Let's seal that. You have two cavities. Let's fix that. She's like, it can be overwhelming, yes. For these dental professionals, it's all in a day's work. What should I do about that? Yet that work also includes an educational component about preventive care. So we do spend a fair amount of time on oral hygiene instruction, uh, tips in terms of diet, and things that they do on a daily basis to help maintain themselves and improve their dental health in the future. In the future, Padua Evans hopes to have dental insurance, but if not, she'll look to come back here again next year. I'm super grateful. I mean, I think, I just think it's incredible. In Golden Valley, Delane Cleveland, 12 News.